The Manuscript of Survival, Part 319. June 6, 2013. All the stops have come out now, and the flux of energy swirling on the outside and indeed inside of you will make it rather difficult to stay in balance now. As we have discussed earlier, the necessity of removing any obstacles from your channel was a highly important one, as otherwise, your connection to the information and energy you are here to convey to others will be restricted. So now, as so many old scars and bonds have been broken and removed, it may be as if a veritable dam of information is cascading into you at a very rapid pace. Some of it is indeed coming into your system from the outside, or the grid as it were. But what may come as a surprise to some of you, is the amount of information that is actually coming from yourself. You see, when the blockages are removed, you stand freer to start to really connect with your own energy, the whole of your being, that is contained not only within this physical body of flesh and blood on planet Earth, but also all of those higher aspects of you whom you have been separated from for such a long time. So yes, Finding yourself suddenly hearing yourself talking to yourself will not be an uncommon experience these days. Many will call this intuition, or just a hunch or a gut feeling, but what you are truly experiencing, is your own inherent wisdom finally being given a voice. And we do mean that in a very literal way, for you will find that from now on, much of the information you find yourself accessing will not only come in the form of an understanding and emotion or just a hunch, it will indeed come in the form of very specific worded information. So do not be surprised if you suddenly find yourself saying out loud things that will make you think, where did that come from? For you will be getting better and better at accessing this, your own internal sage, and together, the two of you will start to explore many interesting fields. Yes, we did say the two of you, for even if these are all aspects of the same being, the very fact that your higher self can communicate with someone literally embedded into humanity will make this exploration not only very interesting, but also vital. Not just for you, but for all of creation. You see, you are the ground crew, in every aspect of the word, and you are the only ones literally straddling the divide between humanity and the rest of creation. You may think of yourselves as tiny little creatures, without any impact at all. Not just on this whole wide world of yours, but also when you look into the dark night sky and look at the multitude of stars out there. It will make you feel like a tiny and insignificant speck, when the truth is in fact the opposite. For you are the only ones in a position to be able to bring these two aspects together in one and the same physical body, and the combination of your higher self and your earth persona is one that has no like in all of creation. So we say, Count yourselves lucky to be right where you are at at the moment, for even if the discomfort, unease and intense physical pressure can be more than a little discouraging, it is also an experience that nothing else can compare to. For you are indeed masters of creation, but you are also spiritual beings ensconced within a complex biological structure, on a planet with a wholly unique setup, and what you can accomplish together has never been seen before. Not here nor anywhere else. So make sure to enjoy the ride dear ones, even if the thrills and spills may seem more than a little overwhelming at times. So let us just finish off this missive by urging you all to sit down and dial your own number on your internal phone and say hello, I am here, may I speak to myself please? And then see what happens. We are sure you will all get a few laughs and maybe more than a few tears of gratitude as you start to realize just how amazing you truly are. The Constant Companions Channeled by Asia North Asianorth.wordpress.com